Hey, so you hopefully have watched my update video. Um, it is the 23rd of December 2014 and um, I'm doing well mostly. I still experience anxiety but it's much less. Um, I feel more confident in myself and I'm beginning to have a taste of recovery once more. So I just want to talk about what recovery looks like for me because obviously it's different for different people, different situations, different mental illnesses. Um, I have a number of comorbid illnesses. The main ones are bipolar disorder, OCD, generalised anxiety disorder, panic disorder and borderline personality disorder. Um, there are others which I'll talk about in another video um, but these are the ones that I suffer from predominantly. So in terms of the bipolar disorder which is my primary disorder, recovery is feeling less depressed and feeling less manic, no longer having these episodes, um, obviously still having to take all my medications and everything for that but you know not having those symptoms anymore and um, I'm fingers crossed uh, that's looking quite realistic for me right now. As regards anxiety, feeling less anxious obviously, um, ruminating less, having fewer uh, rituals and compulsions um, in respect of the OCD um, and having fewer panic attacks. And uh, this is everything that I am experiencing. Um, finally, I say it quite tentatively, but um, nonetheless, I do feel confident that I am now embarking on a period of recovery from my anxiety spectrum disorders. And borderline personality disorder, I'm going to make one or two videos on that separately. Um, but yes, I had traits of BPD. Um, there was no, no real agreement among the professionals as to whether I do have the disorder proper. But I felt that my traits were so pronounced that I really empathised with other people with BPD and their accounts of what they've been going through. It's an illness that manifests itself um, in very diverse ways um, so it can look very different in one person than it can in another patient but you know I'll talk more about that another day but one of the hallmarks of the disorder is self-harm and um, it doesn't always have to be cutting um, it can be overdosing and other destructive behaviours and so I feel I'm recovering from that and I don't have any urges to harm myself and I haven't for several months um, possibly even a year um, so I'm hoping that I'm recovering from that disorder um, if I had it in the first place um, yeah, so um, I think that I'm taking some positive steps um, in my mental health, recovering from these illnesses, and I just thought that I would share something positive with you all.